What's up everyone, welcome back to the channel. I'm here at a pretty cool Italian car show. Uh, here we got the brand new Ferrari 296 GTV along with a bunch of other very cool Lamborghinis and Ferraris. But let's go check out some of the other cars. We got three Lamborghini Aventador Ultimates over there. And of course the new 296 GTV, but let's go check out some of the other cars. All right, over here we got three of the new Lamborghini Aventador Ultimates. The two Aventador Ultima Roadsters here, both 250 in the world, so very cool to see. And then right next to them we have a third one, which is just a normal Aventador Ultima Coupe, one of 350 in the world, finished in Viola Parsifé. But unfortunately, people are standing in front of it right now, but I'll try to get close, close to it in like a minute so I can check it out. But very cool to see three of them when there's only just a couple hundred of these in the world and they're the final Ventador. Over here we have the brand new Ferrari 296 GTB. Uh, just a little bit about the car, it has a 3 liter uh, V6 from Ferrari. <laughs> Uh, pushes about 819 horsepower and does 0 to 60 in 2.8 seconds. But in my opinion, I don't really like it that much, but that might just be me. I honestly think a lot of other Ferraris look a lot better than this, but I think it's a decent car. But I don't know. Let me know what you guys think because I don't really like it that much. Back to the Aventador Ultima since there's starting to clear up over here. Just a little bit about the car, it has a naturally aspirated V12 engine from Lamborghini and it pushes about 769 horsepower, so one of the more, one of the more powerful Lamborghinis to be made. Still love the spec on this one, also of course, two more next to it, but also there's a, an Aventura Pirelli Edition Roadster over there, I'm gonna go check that out, but interesting spec on this, all three of these. Got the purple one and viola parsifé, orange and the green with the kind of bronze wheels over here. Very cool spec on this Lamborghini Venture Ultima. Like I said, finished in viola parsifé, and it's got the white accents, cool, which is very nice. Uh, I saw this car on the Festival del Toro rally, which is all Lamborghinis. Second time seeing this car. This one actually is not stock. It has a very loud aftermarket exhaust. But I am really loving the Aventador Ultima. I think it's a really great way to finish the Aventador generation. But I love the spec on this one. It's not very often you get to see a Ferrari 599. There's actually two, two more on the other side of the show, which I'll check out soon. But very cool spec on this one as well. I like how the dark blue matches the kind of the brown interior. Don't know if you can see that, but very cool spec. Like I said, it, these cars are very rare nowadays. One of the last naturally aspirated uh, Ferraris. V12 engine, sounds amazing. But you don't really see these very often, unfortunately. But it's very cool to see. Over here we have a Lamborghini Ventador Pirelli Edition Roadster. There's only 15 of these made in the entire world. I believe there's 85 in total or 100 total. There's only 15 Roadsters. This is a Roadster, so it's very cool to see. Very rare car. This is the third one I've seen. I've seen a white one. I've seen Stradman's wide body Pirelli Edition Roadster. And now this one, so it's very cool to see. Off at the other end of the show, we have a Lamborghini Huracan Performante Spider from Lamborghini Paramus. Love the forged carbon here on the hood. Performante is just such a clean car. God, we got some STOs over there as well. I'm gonna check out. But 
Look at the spec on this Euros as well. Matte black with the blue accents. Personally, I really like this spec. This might be one that I would go with if I got the Euros. Very clean. Of course, we got some F430s over here. 430 Spider. And we ready? have the Ferrari 599s for over here. I was just talking about how they're, you don't really see them that often, but there's two of them right here. I think I've actually seen this one before, but still very cool to see in person. Got a 430 Scuderia Scud. Very nice to see. Classic red with the gray stripes. And over here we got some Huracan SEOs. But this is a very cool spec. I love the matte black with the red accents. Next to we got a green one. But honestly, favorite generation of the Huracan for me. SCO just has a really cool, aggressive, you know, race car kind of look to it, and I love that. Over here we got an Aventador SVJ Roadster. Very cool, like, kind of matte green spec. Next we got an 812 GTS and a 4.8 piece to behind it. Um, also, there's a lot of noise going on in the background, but I'm going to try my best to talk over it. So I just got to try to deal with that for today, but... Got a couple more Ferraris tucked back there. 812 and an F8. Unfortunately, I can't get back there though because it's roped off, but that's the best I can do. But very cool to see these cars. parked right outside the show also all the other ferraris back here got some cars in the other parking lot over here that's the martin vantage ca corvette there's a couple other supercars back here so i'm gonna go find them back here there's a ferrari 488 gtb and a mclaren 720s in the valet parking very nice. I've actually seen these cars before, but still cool to see. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you have not already, and I'll see you guys all in the next one.